Hi guys, welcome back to another edition of Parv's Kitchen. It is wonderful to see you back again this weekend. Thank you so much for joining me. Today I'm going to show you a recipe that my husband absolutely loves. I am going to be making some smoked haddock scotch eggs. Um, I'm doing it with chicken eggs today. Um, I also do it with quail's eggs. Um, either way, my husband is delighted whenever they're on the menu, so they go down a treat, serve them with a nice mixture of pickles, something tart to give it lots and lots of flavour and texture. It's absolutely wonderful. It is a little bit of a labour of love, but believe me, it is so nice. If you've got a special party or something, do the little ones with quail's eggs because that way they make the most amazing canopies. But for dinner, I prefer just to do it with chicken eggs or duck eggs um, because one or two and you've got a full meal depending on the size of appetite. I really hope you enjoyed the recipe. For this one, I'm using smoked haddock, but it's out of the packet from the supermarket. Um, I didn't have time to make it to the fishmonger, so I didn't get the natural smoked haddock, but this is to show you that either will work and it's a great way to get fish into the diet. So I hope you enjoy the recipe and do give it a go. So for my ingredients, I have got a couple of beautiful smoked haddock fillets, they're boneless. I'm going to poach them just covered in milk, flavoured with bay leaf and peppercorn. And I've already got some mashed potato made up, so normally I would put onion and some other aromats in the milk. This time I'm going to show you the simple version to use up homemade mashed potato. And I'm actually using normal free-range organic eggs. They're beautiful and they're chicken eggs. So I'll let you see what I do once the fish is ready to poach. Now that's the smoke haddock fillets in the pan. I've added the milk, I've added the bay leaves and the peppercorns. I've got it on my lowest gas setting and I'm going to let it gently poach until it's just cooked. Then I'll take it off, skin it and mix it through the potato. So what I've done now is I've poached the smoked haddock, taken it out of the poaching milk and flaked it. I've also removed the skin and I've got these beautiful just poached chunks of haddock. I'm going to mix it in with my mashed potato, season it, and then I'm going to coat soft boiled eggs with it. I'll let you see as I go. Now what I have is my mashed potato, my smoked haddock, and I have soft boiled and shelled my eggs. Now you can tell I'm not the best at doing them. I think my eggs might have been a bit too fresh. However, that's some done. Now that's the potato and haddock all mixed through. All I've done is lightly seasoned it with white pepper. I haven't added very much salt at all, possibly about a quarter of a teaspoon because remember the haddock is smoked. I have doubled up a length of cling film and what I am going to do is put a dollop of the potato in my pan, put the egg in it and then cover the egg. I'll let you see once they're done. So that's the eggs. All I've done is I popped some flour into a bowl, seasoned it, whisked up some egg and I'm using packet bread crumbs today. So all I'm going to do is dip each egg into the flour, then into the egg, then into the breadcrumbs, and I'm going to set them aside on my tray before I fry them. Here they are, frying away beautifully. I'll let you see once they're done. Just flip them over, looking lovely. So guys, that's it. Smoked haddock, eggs, 
and they are absolutely wonderful. They go down a treat. My brother really enjoys them and my mum does as well because she loves smoked fish. I really hope you give it a go. I hope you're enjoying the recipes. Please pass on any comments that you have. Please let your friends and family know and I look forward to seeing you again next weekend at Parv's Kitchen. So eat well and look after yourself. Bye-bye now.